I wondered whether Sudarshan, and you could maybe start with talking about how the pandemic has reshaped our understanding of the generics and biosimilar supply chain. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Dave, for this uh, very insightful questions. Uh, like last 18 months have been very, very important for all of us. And we said that we were not very sure how do we make sure that supply of medicines is there. One of the important things is I've never seen this kind of collaboration between government uh, companies, which are competitors, they coming together, industry, all the industry associations coming together, ancillary industries coming together and making sure that patient is the center of everything and we make products available. I'll give you a lot of examples uh, like say logistics service providers or say channel members. They were there to make sure that the medicines are available for the patient. The workers have been there in the factories to make the production available. Uh, and that was very important that during this time, we got the importance of safety of employees which became the highest priority. So one of the big three, some of the learnings of this pandemic is collaboration is important because at the end of the day, patient is the center of everything what we do. And hence, everyone has to collaborate and patient becomes supreme to make the medicine available. Point number one. Point number two is that each one should work together. Uh, and in this difficult time, uh, like the channel partners and all those, they become important. And the safety of the employees, that become very important. And the third part which became very important is digitalization. In the first three months, whatever digitalization took place, in fact, in many of the industries, what we are talking about is what we planned by 2025, we have been able to do it in the first six months. So that has been the reshaping of the industry. So these are the three important variables which got into the whole thing. And last point is the regulatory, the many of the uh, regulatory authorities responded for emergency use authorizations for the medicines during this time. I will stop here and then build up.